Ancestors, or you get grew up, you get the things from the environment. So people are not individual related like how they are, but the environment are the countings of all represent even the individual. So I will put this book in the description. So just if you want to read, if you want a translation, I can explain you. But this is a handbook of seven visions. One wise lesson. Don't trust someone with one. Don't trust someone with one vision. So 
So the second book I want to talk is The Diet Snake um, die Genese Waardigen for Psychosociale Hulverleners. Diet Skills for Cycled Social Workers. It's a written book. Steps are written to solve a case. Nine out of ten people on the work floor are not trained or did even go to school to get a job. You know why? People won't pay for their own education. The ordination also don't want pay for the education of poor people. From the whole organization and the For example, in this case, there is a six step plan, six steps to solve a problem. Definitely wrote first. Step one is the situation, so step two is the moral problem. Three, uh, step three is what uh, a hard uh, list of actions and betrothal means uh, the people who are. In the, the situation, or the people who are in the situation, what and norm. It means uh, what ethical things are in this situation. Keuze van handelingsalternatief means um, what are you going to decide of um, the steps of the whole situation. People who are not trained. Don't think about steps. They see one thing, they look at the first impression, they decide based on the first impression to make a decision for a solution. On the work floor, when there's a case, nine out of ten times, there is no case. They don't know how to build a case. We don't know how to build a case, there's no case. There are a lot of clients, they tried a lot in the elder care, like people with dementia, when they say a lot of people and they, they work in health, elderly care. When they have problem, they say, always say, I tried everything. I tried everything to guide people with dementia. If you say that to me, I know you're messing with me because I know you're not trained you're not trained but you also work with elderly people but you say you try everything but that's not true because there's a steps a lot of steps to solve the problem well, when people say they tried everything then I will ask what did you try and the things you try did you reflect on and what is the plan before you try into the action? What's the plan? And we have a case. Did you do a research? And who did the research? Where did the research find place? And what did you research? Now there are a lot of things before you take action. In reality, people take action before they build a case, before they did the research. They already decide. They already already decide the solution for the the problem that actually not the real problem. So this is a handbook written uh, of the steps to solve a, a problem, solve a case. The other book, the first book, was a handbook to understand human behavior. Mm. This is a nice book. I love the psychology book. This book is about how to conversate, how to talk to people about the meaning of life. What's the meaning of life? In uh, the elderly care, you live in a residence home. Mm. People lost everything. They want to talk. Nine of the ten people, uh, my co-workers, are not trained. Mm. 
I have two departments under my wing. I have to coach 75 uh, co-workers. I have 35 clients. But mm, I know the co-workers, when they talk, they talk. But what the client really wants, they talk, want to talk about the meaning of life. There are people, they want to talk about what's for them important. What's important in their life. The deeper conversation about, you know, about love. Mm -hmm. For example, um, there was a man, a client. So, he's disabled. A lot of co-workers did. He, he will not learn how to work with technology. I say to the co-workers, that is not what you decide of what the man, disabled man, um, cannot use the technology. It is, we have to research, do a research about what he wants in life. What's the meaning of life? People already decide that this man cannot work with technology because he's disabled. But what this man wants is, uh, yeah, he, he actually wants to work with technology. Mm, he wants to try. But most important, what's the meaning of life here? He wanted to see some, um, he want to uh, use the technology to see some movies. Mm, the movies of his time. So every time people um, didn't trust, he he knew how to work with this technology. Mm. This for this man, that was the meaning of his life to see the old movies back in the days. So there was a, a computer. I learned him how to use with the computer. So see the old movies back in the days. Mm. There was also mm, a group session. Um, there was 10 years ago, there was 10 years no group session, so I was the first one. Um, I worked with the spirit counselor to um, organize the group session with the people talk about the meaning of life, about what's really important in life. Some people, they say, yeah, my partner died. They want to talk about their died partner or they want to talk about Mm -hmm. Search for new love, you know, some kind of topics. It's really important for the people what, what they want in life. Mm. So some, um, some really things, for example, is um, what in the book is really good about what can be difficult for social workers. Guiding clients is um, the social worker can make two wrong mistakes. The first mistake is you feel you go after your own feelings when you want to solve a case. You don't go after the feelings of the client. You think with your own feelings. You don't ask the feelings of the client, but you think of the own feelings. That's the first mistake. The second mistake is uh, you want to save the client. You think the client is hurting and you want to save him from his pain. But actually, the client doesn't want this. Actually, the client wants some distraction. It is a really good book. For example, of um, what I do with in the group session is this. Your card. This is also um, a tool for me to talk with people as a tool with people in a group session. For example, this is difficult, eh? but I'll show you. I'll show you it's more easy. Mm. I'll show you Jocelyn. Uh, this is uh, you're interested. Thank you very much. There are a lot of pictures of representing what you see what you see is different than what I see in the pictures it's like you see a beaver I see something cute animals 
I like cute animals, you know. This is something I like cute things. For example, mm. what do you see? Four people. Mm. Do you see four people walking? Or do you see four people not communicating with each other? Mm. This man. I see this man is the important man, the man, the leader with the suitcase. Like this man is a dreamer. He walks to another direction. Well, this man, this man is in argument with this man. He says, yo, man, what's up, man? He makes the hand gesture like this. Well, this man, he says, yo, Wanna talk, man? What? What? Like this? Like they are in a conflict. Was that interesting to see what they have? Driving cars. What do you see? This is something you know, I used in group session. Just a tool to start a conversation with people about their life, talking about their life. Two cars you see. But do you see more? But how can you compare it in your life? It's like people drive so fast. People can drive so fast. Driving can be dangerous. But more dangerous is fast, fast life. Life can be fast. Like this car. When you drive fast, you can live fast. It actually is not uh, predictable what happened in life. When you drive, you can cause an accident. But you, when you live, you can die at every moment. So what is life? Life is unpredictable. But when you drive, you enjoy the environment where you go. But still in life. Even you walk, you can also enjoy the environment. You don't have to be, don't have to be in the car. Depends what you see in the picture. And couch. And couch. With a plastic bag. Mm. What do you see? Is a couch. Mm. Abandoned by someone. Plastic bag, some goods, a bin. What's that? A trash bin. A trash bin, like this, looks like someone threw about the bank. When I think of it, my fish, and I see some, I throw my old stuff away. I want my new stuff, new couch, everything new, a new beginning in life. I want to start over again. That is what I see in this picture. Money, money, money. You see money? I see money too. Uh, what do you see? Money is important in life. I gotta tell you, this is my vision. Vision is no matter how rich you are, are you happy? Is money in that important? Of it, or is your health much more important? Justly, what do you think? Is money that important? Happiness. Money cannot buy happiness. Money cannot buy love. Money can. You can buy everything with money. Materialistic. You can buy everything. I can buy everything with my money. But still, you cannot buy happiness. You cannot buy health. This meaning in life is just to have your goal. You know, to have people surrounded by you who cares about you. People who love you, who care for you. Be safe, people.
fix with this cause and the, and the, the dinner sorted. So do you see? Beautiful environment. The side of the beach, water, plain. No, sorry. It is a plain. Watch from the plain over the over the sea. I use it as a metaphor with the helicopter view. You stay his from above to look at the work floor. What happens? You don't look at the impression, first impression, but you look at the whole situation. I'll pick the card. Let me shuffle the card. And then I'll pick the card. No matter what kind of picture it is like. I don't care about picture it is you and you pick a picture the colors on the picture I can tell you different color in life what means different color in life is different situation no matter what kind of color When I smell, it's just like I feel, yeah, like this. When I'm happy, I'm this. When I'm not happy, I'm blue. <laughs> I like yellow, orange, green is my favorite color. Thank you for your interest, uh, Jocelyn. My summary, what I talk about, this book is about uh, talking conversation, start conversation about meaning of life. Second book is the handbook for the steps that used to solve a case. So there's more explain about solve case. And the third book is a handbook about seven, seven visions to understand human behavior. So, thank you very much. Have a nice day.